Good night, teacher. Hello, good night. Welcome to the class. Okay, let's wait for everybody. Everybody overslept. Se les pegó la cobija. Good night, teacher. Hello, good night, Leticia. How are you? Fine, thank you, teacher. Nice, nice to hear that. Nice to hear that. So let's see how many. Okay, let's see here. Five, four students. Let's wait a little bit so we can start everything together. Nice music, teacher. Thank you. Thank you very much. I like Good it night. because it's like relax. Okay. It's very nice. relaxed. That is deep house. Deep house music. Ah, okay. I think um, electronic music. Yeah, okay. I listen to electronic music too, but this is deep, deep house. It's, deep it's, house. It's, it's a different than, than the electronic. Um, okay. But it's, nice. it's kind of similar. It's kind of similar. They have like the, the same sound. Okay. Hi, nice. <laughs> I see you, Nancy. Yes. <laughs> is, it, is it raining over there by your house? No. no it's not raining. No raining. Ooh. Nothing. It's nice. hot. Oh, man. All day hot. <laughs> you want to go swimming? <laughs> yeah. Um, Saturday or Monday. On the weekend, on the weekend, yeah. yes, on the weekend, pretty good. Okay, I see many people coming in. I see Felix, Lester, Karen, Flor, Leticia, Jose, Stephanie, Ninette, Dennis. But we're still missing a lot of people. Good night. Hey, good night. Welcome to the class. Welcome to the class. Thank you. Okay, so remember yesterday um, we were working on the tenses. Um, do you remember what, what was the last tense we practiced? ¿Se acuerdan cuál fue la última, um, el último tiempo que practicamos? El que practicamos ayer. Present perfect. Present perfect. Or simple present. Present perfect. Mm. I think was present perfect. Okay, Thank present you. perfect, very good. Yeah, okay, so right now we have practiced five tenses. Hasta el momento hemos practicado cinco tiempos de los seis que les dije que les iba a enseñar. So, present continuous, simple future, simple past, simple present, present perfect, y el último que es past continuous or past progressive. Ese es el último, past continuous or past progressive. So, son seis tiempos los que tienen que manejar bien para un buen inglés, para que entiendan bien y para que puedan contestar bien. So, aquí van las estructuras y las, y las preguntas guías, tal como deben de hacerlas y tal como deben de contestar. ¿Ok? Ok. Ok, creo que vamos a comenzar para no, no, no entretenernos mucho. Okay, let's begin. Let's put this down. Okay, so uh, let me. I'm going to share my my PowerPoint presentation, which I have it in simple present. Pero esto ya lo hicimos, dice. So let's go. Ya hicimos eso. Ah, oh, ya hicimos este. What does Jill do? Si ¿Sí lo hicimos. Vale, entonces sí, entonces vamos al presente simple. No es al, yes. no es al presente perfecto, es presente simple. 
Porque esto ya lo vimos. Mira. Desde aquí comienza el presente simple. What is the simple present? The simple present also called present simple or present indefinite. It's a verb tense which is used to show repetition, habit, or generalization. Less commonly, the simple present can be used to talk about schedule actions in the near future and in some cases, actions happening now. Yo creo que esto lo leyó Leticia, sí. ¿Se acuerda, Leticia? No. Me acuerdo que leí, pero no era ese porque el otro decía en la segunda línea el pretérito, hablaba del pretérito. En la segunda línea. Ah, pues fue el pasado simple. Simple past. Este era. Simple past, teacher. Este es simple past. Simple future. Este es simple future. Ah, oh, simple past fue el que le dio Leticia. Ah, ¿Verdad? Sí. Ajá. Uh -huh. Este este era. Ese era. Ah, pues sí, nos quedamos en presente simple. Presente simple vamos a hacer en este momento, entonces. Llevamos tres, entonces. Present continuous, simple future, simple past. Ok, acordémonos de algo. What is the general question for present continuous? General question for present continuous. What are you doing? Thank you. What are you doing? What are you doing? Esa es la pregunta general del presente continuo. And what does it mean? What are you doing? What does it mean in Spanish? ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué estás haciendo? Thank you. ¿Qué estás haciendo? A general question for simple future. What are you doing? What are you going to do? Very good. What are you going to do? Simple future. What are you going to do? ¿Y qué significa en español? ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué vas a hacer? So, vean la diferencia de un tiempo a otro. Por eso es que les digo las definiciones tanto en inglés como en español para que no se equivoquen. So, let's go for simple past. What is the general question for simple past? What do you do? No. Simple past? Mm -hmm. What did you do? Oh, sí. What did you do? Ojo con los auxiliares. What did you do? Ese es el... Simple past. What, what did you do? ¿Y qué significa en español? What does it mean? ¿Qué hiciste? Yes. So, fíjense. ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué hiciste? Ahora vamos con el cuarto, que es el presente simple. Simple present. Simple present. What is the simple present? Ok. Fabricio, can you read this, please? What is the simple present? The simple present also called call present simple or present in the definite. Indefinite. 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 It's a verb tense which is used to show repetition, habit on generalization. Less commonly, the simple present can be used to talk about a show action is in the near future and in the Some case action happening now. Very good, very good. Okay, so let me explain how the simple the simple present talks about uh, three things. Oh, tenemos los primeros tres. Present continuous habla is an action. Talks about action or verb. So una acción es un verbo. So el presente continuo es una acción o verbo sucediendo en el momento. Ok. Simple future es una acción o verbo que va a suceder en el futuro y va a terminar en el futuro. Simple past, acción o verbo que va a comenzar y va a terminar. No, que comenzó y terminó en el pasado. Y ahora, este es diferente. El presente simple habla de tres cosas. Uno, habla de habitual. Uh, uh, que sería habitual activity son eh, como sería hábitos hábitos es número uno número dos costumbres y número tres eh, verdades o cosas que uno no puede cambiar verdades eh, so, por ejemplo uh, una verdad sería my name is Absido nadie puede cambiar mi nombre so, esa es una verdad costumbres I go to church every Sunday. Y a, a, a hábito, I take a shower every day. 
I drink coffee in the morning. Take. So, the tres cosas habla el presente simple. Hábito, costumbres y verdades. ¿Estamos? ¿Entendimos eso? Ok, los primeros tres son acciones sucediendo en cualquier de determinado momento. Pero el cuatro, el presente simple, habla de tres cosas. Hábito, costumbres y... Man, ya se les olvidó. Verdades, yeah. verdades, verdades, verdades. <ríe> yeah, ya, los, ya los tengo dormidos. <ríe> ok, so, vamos, continuemos. ¿Alguna pregunta antes de continuar? No. No, Vale, tenemos cuatro. En presente continuo lo conocemos cuando utilizamos ING en los verbos. Futuro siempre porque utilizamos going to. Pasado simple porque utilizamos did en las preguntas, en la auxiliar did en las preguntas, pero en respuestas damos el verbo en pasado. ¿Ok? Was, was. Y el, el presente simple lo vamos a conocer porque utilizamos los auxiliares do y das. Do y das. ¿Ok? Continuamos. Ya esto ya lo, ya lo conocen. Vamos con lo primero. La pregunta general es... What do you do? Todos, what do you do? 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 Vamos, William. I sing songs. 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 ¿Qué significa esa respuesta en español? Cantando canciones. Yo canto canciones. Bien. Yo canto canciones. Yo canto canciones. En pasado simple, yo canté canciones. I sang songs. En futuro simple, I'm going to sing songs. Y en presente continuo, I'm singing a song. Okay. Vean la diferencia. Ok. So, esta es la, la pregunta general del presente simple. What do you do? What time do you sing a song? 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 I sing a song at 9 p.m. I sing a song at 9 p.m. No me diga night. Nine. 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 I sing a song at 9 p.m. I sing a song at 9 p.m. Where do you sing a song? Where, where do you, you sing, a, where song? Do you sing, sing a, song? a song? Where do you sing a song? Where do you sing a song? Where do you sing a song? I sing a song in 40 y 20. I sing, I sing a song, a song, a song in 40 y 20. 20. When do you sing a song? When, when do you, do you sing, sing a song? song? I sing a song every day. I sing a song every day. Why do you sing a song? Why, why, why do, do you, you sing, sing a song? song? I sing a song because I like it. I sing a song because I like it. Who sings a song? 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 I sing a song. I sing a song. I sing a song. Whose song do you sing? Whose song, song, song do you sing? Whose song do you sing? Whose song do you sing? Whose song do you sing? I sing a Brian Adams song. I, I sing, sing a Brian Adams song. Adam song. Oh. What kind of song do you sing? What kind of song do you sing? Do you sing? What kind of songs do you sing? What, what kind of songs, songs do, you do you sing? I sing a romantic song. I, I sing, sing a romantic, a romantic song. song. Oh, I sing a romantic song. Allí me equivoqué. Yo, la A no tendría que ir porque canciones es plural. So la A se elimina. I sing romantic songs. I, I sing, sing romantic, romantic songs. That's for you, teacher. Yeah, my bad, my bad. <laughs> Okay, how do you sing a song? How do you sing a song? How do you sing a song? 
How, How do you, do you, you sing, sing a song? song? I sing a song with a lot of feelings. I, I sing, sing a song with, song with, with a, a lot, lot of feelings. Of feelings. Of feelings. Oh. How often do you sing a song? How, How often, often do you sing a song? A song? I always sing a song. I, I always, always sing a song. song. Okay. Screenshot. No me la comparta a WhatsApp. Solo can you do en la clase. Screenshot. No. Ready. Yes. ¿Ya todos lo tienen? Yes. Vale, de una sola vez vamos a hacer la, la de tercera persona también, ¿ok? No. Screenshot. Tercera persona. ¿Ya? Ya. Okido, okido, okido. Ok. So, van a hacer así. Van a dirigir la pregunta, ¿ok? Por ejemplo, si está Leticia, Fabricio y Nancy en un, en un cuarto, en un, en un aula. So, va a dirigir la pregunta. Por ejemplo, Leticia le va a decir, Fabricio, uh, what does you do? Entonces Fabricio va a contestar y luego Fabricio va a dirigir la pregunta a la otra persona, ¿ok? Todos los días tenemos una relación muy linda, hemos sabido ser una un equipo. Okay, here we go. Go to your rooms and start practicing. Go to your rooms and start practicing. Hi teacher, I have a low battery. I'm going to check my phone and I will connect in okay. a few minutes. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Okay, let me okay. know. Okay. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, go to your rooms and start practicing. Guys, go to your classroom, to, to your room, and start practicing. no es esta como no pero se inicia con la que está en celestito ah pero la primera what do you do sí no la sé. primera what do you do es cierto I sing song what time do you sing a song Leticia I sing a song at 9 p.m. Sofía where do you where do you sing a song Ruth, where do you sing a song? Um, I sing a song at 9 p.m. No, where? Where do you sing where a song? Do you? Ah, okay. I sing a song in 40 y 20. Lizette, when do you sing a song? I sing a song every day. Why do you sing a song, Leticia? I sing a song because I like it. Ruth, uh, who does sing a song? I sing a song. Uh, Sofia, whose song do you sing? 
No, Sofía, bueno, no con Leticia. Ajá, Leticia, entonces. Ahí sí, a uh, Brian Anderson. A ver, Ruth. Eh, ¿What Tiene King? Oh. El micrófono. Ah, ok. Ok, okay. Uh, so, okay. thank you, teacher. Eh, Sofía. Who does sing a song? I sing a song. Whose songs do you sing, eh, Maritza? I sing, eh, no, I sing Brian Adams songs. Okay. Reina, what kind of song do you sing? I sing romantic songs. Eh, Stephanie, how do you sing a song? Um, I sing a song like a pro. Uh, Nancy, how often do you sing a song? I always sing a song. Uh, practicamos la otra. The second. Screenshot. Ok. Siempre la compartirá usted, Reinita. Sí, ahorita. Okay. What does Jill do? Um, what does Maritza? Jill? What does Jill, Jill, do? Jill do? Maritza? She sings. She sings songs. She sings. She sings. She sings songs. Um, What, pregunta, Maritza. What time does Jill sing a song, teacher? She sings a song <laughs> at 9 p.m. Okay. Um, pregúntele a Nancy. <laughs> okay, Nancy, where does Jill sing a song? She sing a song in 40 y 20. Good. What does Jill sing a song, Reinita? She sings a song every day. Why, is, why does Jill sing a song, Stephanie? She sings a song because she likes, likes it. She likes it. She likes it. Likes it. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. She sings a song because she likes it. Mm, who does sing a song, Marixa? Jill sings a song. Um, Stephanie, whose songs does Jill sing? She sings Brian Adams' songs. Uh, Reinita, what kind of of songs and that's Jill sing. She sings romantic songs. Uh, Nancy, how does Jill sing a song? She sings a song like a pro. How often does Jill sing a song, um, Maritza? She always sings a song. Nancy, what does Jill do? She sings a song. What time does Jill sing a song, uh, Stephanie? Okay, let's see who's coming back. Is everybody here? Only 20 students. Okay, um, so let's move on. So that was, um, that was the simple present. Remember simple present talks about habits, 
uh, customs and truth, general truth, okay? Good. So let's move on with the next thing. Veamos que tenemos después. So after this is present perfect. Okay, what is the present perfect? Stephanie, can you read this, please? Yes, the present perfect, the present perfect tense refers to an action or a state that either occurred at an indefinite time in the past. We have talked before or began in the past and continued to the present time. He has grown in pattern over the last hour. This tense is formed by have, has, plus the past participle. Very good, thank you. Okay, so we just finished the simple present. Acabamos de terminar el presente simple. And we know that we're talking about the simple present because we use the auxiliaries do and does. ¿Cómo conocer el presente simple? Porque utilizamos los auxiliares do y does. Ahora tenemos el número 5, que es the present perfect. Ojo, si el presente simple habla de tres cosas, que son eh, verdades, costumbres y hábitos, el presente perfecto es totalmente diferente. Ok, present perfect talks about an action that started in the past and may continue in the present and also to the future. So, el presente perfecto toma un verbo o una acción que ha comenzado en el pasado puede continuar en el presente y puede seguir en el futuro. Ojo, una acción que comenzó en el pasado puede continuar en el presente hasta el futuro. ¿Ya? Este es un poquito más largo. Entonces, ojo. ¿Cómo lo vamos a conocer de que estamos hablando del de presente perfecto? Porque aquí utilizamos dos auxiliares que es have y has. Have para primeras personas y plurales y has para tercera persona singular. ¿Ok? ¿Entendimos eso? ¿Any questions? No, teacher. Good. Okay. No, teacher. Any right. question. Right. Entonces, tenemos ya cinco. Cinco tiempos. Present continuous, simple future, simple past, simple present, present perfect. Continuamos. Las preguntas de información ya las sabemos de memoria casi, entonces ya no hay problema. Comencemos. Y esta es la pregunta general. Recuerden las preguntas generales anteriores. What are you doing? What are you going to do? What did you do? What do you do? What do you do in... What, what did, did you do? Ok, wait, wait. esta es la pregunta general del presente perfecto. What have you done? What have you done, everybody? What have you done? 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 And what does it mean in Spanish? ¿Qué significa en español? ¿Qué has hecho? Thank you. Thank you. ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Qué has hecho? Ojo. ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué vas a hacer? No, güey. No. ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué vas a ¿Qué hacer? ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué haces? ¿Qué has, ¿Qué has hecho? hecho? ¿Qué has hecho? Okay. So, I have sung a song. I have sung a song. Everybody? I have sung a song. 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 What time have you sung a song? 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 Algunos me están confundiendo song y sang. Me están diciendo song, song. No. What time have you sung a song? What time have you sung a song? Sang. Ok, what otra vez. Time, what time have you sung a song? I have sung a song at 9 p.m. 
have you sung a song? Where have I sung a song? I have sung a song in 40 and 20. I have sung a song in 40 and 20. When have you sung a song? When have you sung a song? I have sung a song on Thursdays. I have sung a song on Thursdays. Why have you sung a song? Why have you sung a song? I have a I have sung a song because I like it. I have a uh, sung, sung a song, a song because, because I like it. I like, I like it. it. I like her. I like it. 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 Who has sung a song? Who has sung a song? Who has sung a song? I have sung a song. I have sung a song. A song. Why have you sung a song? Why have you sung a song? Hey, voy para atrás, un momento. My bad, my bad. Como el cangrejo. Whose song have you sung? 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 I have sung a Brian Adams song. I have sung a What kind of song have you sung? What kind of song have you sung? I have sung romantic songs. I have sung romantic songs. How have you sung a song? How have you sung a song? How have you sung a song? I have sung a song with a lot of feelings. I have, I have sung, sung a song, song with a lot, lot of feelings. feelings. A lot of feelings. How often have you sung a song? How often have you sung a song? How often have you sung a song? I have always sung a song. I have always sung a song. Good. Screenshot. Screenshot. No me la comparto el grupo, please. Solo aquí en la clase lo vamos a usar. ¿La tiene? Yes, teacher. Yes. Ok, de una sola vez. Yes, I got it. De una sola vez, la tercera persona. Screenshot de tercera persona también, please. You got it? Ya la tiene? Yes. Very good. Very good. Ok. So, no perdamos tiempo. Eh, vayan directo a la práctica, ok? No me pierdan tiempo. Porque necesitamos, quiero terminar hoy hasta el, el 6. Nos, nos queda el 6 todavía. Ok, let's go practice. Go to your rooms and practice. You go to your rooms and practice. What have you done? I have song, songs. What time have you sung a song? I have sung a song at 9 p.m. Why have you sung a song? Oh, oh, oh. Wait, wait, wait. Miren, así. Eh, una pregunta a alguien y la siguiente, siguiente pregunta. O oh, sí, como por ejemplo, si le pregunto a Dennis, él contesta. La siguiente pregunta la hace a José. Eh, José contesta. Okay. Y la siguiente pregunta la José la hace a quién más, quién más está acá. 
a Samuel okay. y así sucesivamente. Go. Ok. Ok, okay. Uh, Samuel. Where have you sung a song? Sung. Where have I you have you sung? Sung. Sung a song. I have sung. Sung. Yes, sang. Como, como, I... está como, como, sang, sang. Como, sang a song. Yes, pero con G. Ok. I have sung a song in... Have you sang? Whose who's, 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 who's song? Whose, okay. Whose song have you sung? Sang? I have sung Brian's Adam songs. What kind, what kind of song wait, wait, wait. have you sung? Uh -huh. oh, oh, háganla así. Por ejemplo, usted le pregunta a Maudi, Maudi le responde. Luego Maudi le, le hace la siguiente pregunta a Lester. Lester responde. Luego le uh, hace la siguiente pregunta a Félix. Félix responde y así. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. Eh, yo ah, me equivoqué, yo, no yo entendí así. No uh -huh. problem, no problem. How, eh, how, how you sang a song, uh, Lester? Uh, I have some 40 y 20. Uh, when when have you sung a song, uh, Carlos? I have sung a song every day. Why have you sung a song, Minet? I have sung a song because I like it. Who has sung a song, uh, Rocio? I have sung a song, uh, Ronald. Whose song have you sung? I have sung Brian Adams' song. Uh, what kind of song have you sung, uh, Noe? Uh, permit. Uh, I have sung romantic songs. How have you sung a song, Minette? I have sung a song like a pro. How often have you sung a song, Carlos? Eh, ¿Cuál es la de la cuatro? No, when okay. he has sung, sorry, sorry, he has sung a song every day. Why has Joe sung a song, Marixa? He has sung a song because he like it. He Lice, dijo. Like it. 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 Like Um, he has sung Brian Adams' songs. What kind of songs?
Okay, I'm missing two people. Me faltan dos personas. Se me perdieron. Hay que una. Otra. Me falta una, me falta una. Ahí está el tráfico. <laughs> pues se fue. Ok, good. Um, está cenando. Is <laughs> having dinner. Se me perdió. He's having, I sleep. he's having chocolate and, 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 and pupusas. Okay, let's move on. <laughs> bueno, ya vamos a, a, a la última que es la del de pasado continuo o pasado progresivo. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. Okay, here we go. So we just finished... Uh, Present perfect, so let's go to past continuous. Oh, wait, wait, tengo que arreglar eso. Past continuous. Ahí está. My bad, my bad. Ahí está. Okie dokie. Okay, Flor, can you read this, please? Okay, teacher. Why is the past continuous? The past continuous, also called past progressive, is a verb tense which is used to show that an ongoing past action was happening at a specific moment of, of interruption for that two ongoing actions were happening at the same time. At the same time, very good. Okay, so this is the, the um, again, tiene televisor muy alto. Please. Okay, um, so the past continues is an action happening in the past. So, el presente, el pasado continuo habla de una acción o verbo sucediendo en el pasado. Sucediendo en el pasado. Okay? So, es diferente al presente, al pasado simple, que es un, un verbo o una acción que comenzó y terminó en el pasado. En cambio, este dice que es una acción o verbo que está sucediendo en el pasado. Ok? Y lo vamos a conocer cuando hablamos de él porque utilizamos los auxiliares was and where. Was and where. ¿Ok? Good. ¿Preguntas? No. Ok, let's go. Teacher, yes? sorry, I, uh, yo casi no puedo escuchar porque se oye bastante interrupción. Eso es lo que oigo, un televisor está muy alto. Ok, hoy sí. So, eh, vamos a ver la primera pregunta. La primera pregunta siempre es la pregunta general. Y esta es la del eh, pasado, eh, pasado continuo o pasado progresivo. What were you doing, everybody? What, what were you doing? What were you doing? What were you doing? What were you doing? What, 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 were, you what doing? were you doing? And what does it mean in Spanish? ¿Qué hiciste? No, hiciste el pasado simple. What did you do? ¿Qué has estado haciendo? ¿Qué, ¿Qué, has, estado haciendo? ¿Qué has estado haciendo? ¿Qué estuviste haciendo? ¿Qué estuviste haciendo? ¿Qué estuviste haciendo el pasado simple? ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué estás haciendo el presente simple? ¿Dónde estuviste? <laughs> ¿Dónde? No, no dice where. What? ¿Qué no, haces? No, ¿qué haces? Presente simple. ¿Qué hiciste? Es pasado simple. ¿Qué estuviste, ¿Qué estuviste haciendo? haciendo? Pasado simple. ¿Qué estabas ¿Qué haciendo? Estuviste Eso, haciendo? ¿qué estabas? ¿Qué estabas, ¿Qué estabas haciendo? haciendo? Ven que una simple palabra hace que, que lo mande para otro tiempo. Oh, es por eso que es que necesito que, que, que la definición la tengan bien clara. So, ¿qué estabas haciendo? ¿Qué estabas haciendo? What were you doing? Ojo. Las seis. ¿Qué, qué, ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué haces? ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Y qué estabas haciendo? ¿Qué estabas haciendo? ¿Okay? So, everybody, what were you doing? 
What were, what you, were doing? you doing? What were, what you, were doing? you doing? I was singing a song. I, I was, singing, was singing, singing a song. Yeah. What time were you singing a song? What, what time, time were you singing, were you singing a song? I was singing a song at 9 p.m. I was, I was singing a song, a song at, song at, at 9, 9, 9 p.m. Mm -hmm. Where were you singing a song? Where, 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 where were you singing a song? I was singing a song in 4020. I was singing a song. When were you singing a song? When were you singing a song? I was singing a song on Thursday. I was singing a song on Thursday. Why were you singing a song? Why were you singing a song? I was singing a song. I was singing a song because I like it. I was singing a song because I like it. Who was singing a song? Who was singing a song? Who was singing a song? Singing a song. I was singing a song. I was singing a song. Whose song were you singing? Whose song were you singing? I was singing a Brian Adams song. I would sing a Brian song. What kind of songs were you singing? 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 Ojo, no me están pronunciando la S de la primera songs. Songs. What kind of songs were you singing? What kind of songs are you singing? I was singing romantic songs. I was singing romantic songs. How were you singing a song? How were you singing a song? I was singing a song with a lot of feelings. I was singing a song with a lot of feelings. How often were you singing a song? How often were you singing a song? I was always singing a song. I was always singing a song. Always singing a song. Good. Okay. Screenshot. Primera persona. Screenshot. Primera persona. Screenshot. Screenshot. Okay. 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 Uh, I was singing a song. Tercera persona. Nine p.m. Nine p.m. Nine, nine p.m. Okay. Espérame, aquí hay un error. Un momento, hay un error. Acabo de ver un error ahí. Sorry, my bad, my bad. I was always singing a song. She was singing a song. She was singing a song. Ah, she was singing a song because she likes it. Because she likes it. Okay, cool. So let's leave it here. Okay, just mad. Okay, fix it. Ya está corregido. Vámonos. Okay, take a screenshot. Third person, esta es tercera persona, third person. Okay. Okay, ¿ya la tiene? Yes. Good, let's go. Okay, guys, um, just one thing. Uh, remember that we already done um, six tenses. Present continuous, simple future, simple past, Simple present, eh, present perfect, and past continuous. General questions, las preguntas generales. What are you doing? What are you going to do? What did you do? What do you do? What have you done? What were you doing? Y todas significan algo diferente. ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué haces? ¿Qué has hecho? 
y qué estabas haciendo. ¿Qué estabas haciendo? Okay. Totalmente diferente. Okay. So, vámonos a la práctica. Uh, tienen que corregir. Let, let's do corrections, ¿ok? Let's go practice. Ok, go to your room and practice. I was singing a song. Flor, what time were you singing a song? I was singing a song at 9 p.m. Where were you singing a song, Karen? I was singing a song every day. Where is... Sorry, sorry. Sí. Uh, uh -huh. es where, ¿verdad? La tercera es... ¿Sí? Sí, ok. I was singing a song in 40 y 20. Um, Samuel, when were you singing a song? I was singing a song every day. Uh, Dennis, why were you singing a song? I was singing a song because I like it. Um, José. Yes. Sí. Sí, sí está. Hola. Sí, sí. Hola. José. Who was singing a song? I was singing a song. Uh, uh, who song were you singing? Uh, Sería a, a Samuel. Samuel. Yes. Who song every you singing? I was singing a song, Brian Adams song. Uh, Flor. Uh, what kind of song were you singing? I was singing romantic songs. Who were you singing a song, Dennis? How, how, how? Ah, perdón. How were you singing a song, Dennis? I was singing a song like a pro. How often were you singing a song, uh, Jose? I was always singing a song. Eh, si pueden compartir la otra. Ok, cambiamos. ¿Quién comienza? Ok, hola. What, what was Sui doing? What was Sui doing? Sui doing. Sui. Uh, bueno, sería usted. Igual. Okay. ¿En qué nos quedamos? Bueno, ¿qué was ¿Qué doing? ¿Qué What time was Sue singing a song? Lester. She was singing a song at 9 p.m. Where was Sue singing a song, Maudie? 
she was singing a song in 40 y 20. When was Sue singing a song, uh, Lester? She was... Eh, ¿Cuál fue la pregunta, perdón? Esta. Fue, she, ajá. Was a song. she was singing a la song cuerda. every day. Why, why no, was you no. singing a song, eh, Felix? Uh, she was singing a song because she liked it. That's a, she a likes it. She likes it. Was, she likes it. No, no, no. She likes was singing it. a song because she likes it. She likes it. She likes it. Likes it. Uh, Who was singing a song, Fabricio? Who was singing a song? Whose song was singing a song, Modi? She was singing a Brian's Adam song. No, desde la pregunta, otra vez. Whose song was so singing? Ahora sí. She was singing Brian Adams songs. Okay. okay. Ah, perdón. What kind of song was Sue singing? No, no, uh, no, no, Sue, Sue, Sue. Sue. She was Sue singing. Sue, Sue, ah. Uh, what kind of song was Sue singing? Uh, Fabricio. She was singing romantic song. La How S, was la S, romantic songs. songs. Okay, she was singing roma romantic songs. How was she singing a song, Lester? She was singing a song every day. No. No, esta. Es la oh, penúltima. Perdón. She was singing a song like a pro. Okay. How often was Sue singing a song, Felix? She was always singing a song. What, 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 what was Sue doing, Fabricio? Doing. What was Sue doing? Doing. 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 What was Sue doing? She was singing a song. What time was Sue singing a song, Maldi? She was. Se le fueron tres. Ahora se fueron uno y ahora tres. Ya se hambre. Las pupusitas. Sí. Ok, guys, listen. I am hungry. Well, pareció uno, ¿eh? ¿no? Ok. <risa> let's, let's do this. Para cerrar, acuérdense. Oh, sorry, my bad, my bad. My discotheque. Okay, um, remember that. Aún no es viernes, teacher. Tomorrow. tomorrow. Oh, wait, 
me estoy no. adelantando. Next, the, the day after tomorrow. Thank you. Well, there is. There is. Puchica, teacher, ya quiere descansar de nosotros, ¿va? No, no, no. no, 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 no. Ok, so listen, for now, esos son los seis tiempos que tienen que manejar al 100% para que usted tenga un buen inglés, un bonito inglés, pueda entender y responder con buena estructura y con buenas eh, eh, preguntas guías. Okay? Las preguntas guías son, what do you do? Y la, la estructura, una buena estructura, uh, I eat coffee or I am a teacher, whatever. Okay? So, la, la estructura es cómo usted debe de contestar. Ok. So, tenemos six, present continuous, simple future, simple past, simple present, present perfect, and past continuous. Vamos, eh, rapidito. Eh, preguntas generales. Present continuous. What do you do? Present continuous. What are you doing? What, What are, are you doing? doing? What are you doing? Thank you, you Stephanie. Do. What are you doing? What are you doing? Eh, simple future. What, what are you going, going to, do? to do? What are you going to do? Yes, what are you going to do? Simple past. What, what did you do? you do? What did you do? What did you do? A simple present. What do you do? What, what do you do? do? What do you do? What do you do? Ah, what do you do? What, what do you do? Simple present. Pre present perfect. What have what you have done? You done? What, have what have you done? 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 done? Okay. What have you done? Oh, what have you eh, done? Muchos, muchos, pero muchas personas dicen don, pero esas personas porque han aprendido inglés acá en el país. Y, y la, 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 done, la pronunciación es done. What have no. you done? Oh. En past continuous, past continuous. What were you doing? What were you doing? What were you doing? What were you doing? Entonces, ¿qué significa en español? Present continuous. ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué estabas haciendo? No. Ah, ¿qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué estás haciendo? Simple future. ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué vas a hacer? ¿Qué vas a hacer? Simple past. ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Qué haces? ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Qué haces? No, ¿qué haces? ¿Qué haces? ¿Qué haces? Present perfect. ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Y pas progressive or continuous? ¿Qué estabas haciendo? ¿Qué estabas haciendo? Ojo, si manejan eso así, ya van a saber cómo responder eh, a una pregunta o cómo van a hacer una pregunta. Ojo, no tienen que confundirse. Por eso es que se los quiero eh, preguntar constantemente que lo manejen al 100%. Ahora, vamos con lo, con, lo más, con lo otro importante. ¿Por qué conocemos el tiempo? How do you know that we're talking about the, the tense? Present continuous. ¿Cómo ING. Very good. ING, ING. at the end of verb. En ING al final del verbo. ING at the end of verb. Simple future. Going to. Going to. Yeah, Auxiliary. Stephanie, mm -hmm. Stephanie, you're on fire, Stephanie. Very good. Okay, simple past. <laughs> did. 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 The auxiliary did. In, did. Oh, oh, oh. The auxiliary did in questions, but in answers, the verbs in the past. Was and where. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. no. Do, do it thus. No, no, no. no. Oh, oh, oh. No, wasn't escuchen, well. Escúchenme, escúchenme. Escúchenme. In answer. In por paz, lo conocemos porque lleva el did en las preguntas, pero en las respuestas, el verbo en pasado. Nada de was and where. Mm -mm -mm. Ah, ok, ok. Ojo, ojo, muy importante. En la pregunta va el auxiliar did, pero en respuesta va el verbo en pasado. Ok. Ahora, okay. ¿cómo conocemos el presente simple? Do, do auxiliary do do and does do does, and does. does. Uh -huh. por los auxiliares do and does y cómo conocemos el presente perfecto por los auxiliares have have has have has y cómo conocemos el pasado continuo 
Was where. Was no. where. Was where. Ok. Así lo voy a seguir bombardeando, chicos. Lo voy a seguir bombardeando. Tienen que aprenderse eso. Eso les va a definir de que sigan bien todos esos, los seis tiempos. Ok. So, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night, oh, oh, wait, 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 everybody. Wait. Para mañana, les voy, a, les voy a preparar el verbo más utilizado en todos los, los países que hablan inglés. El verbo más utilizado en los seis tiempos. Ok. So, I'll see you tomorrow. See Estemos tomorrow, temprano mañana. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Have a good night. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Have a good night. Have a good night. Have a good night. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams.